I volunteer with Shaw TV? Well, it's actually a two-sided coin. On the one side, being an Indigenous woman born and raised in Canada, I really grew up believing there were just certain things I would never get to do. And it's, and I want to be crystal clear, it's not because anyone told me I couldn't, it's just I didn't see any Indigenous people doing it. And as a child, you assume that means that's not for you, that other people do that. So when I was asked to host a TV program, I, I was blown away because it definitely wasn't something I saw myself doing. So I had to jump at the chance just to be that example for other people that might be interested. The other side of that coin was caring and loving Thunder Bay. There's so much misunderstanding out there and the stereotypes are alive and well when it comes to Indigenous people and I met so many non-Indigenous people, their heart was in the right place but they either didn't have the information or they were embarrassed to admit they didn't have the information and that's just ridiculous. We need to have the conversation so I thought if I could host this show and having those conversations that they could watch from the privacy in their own home, well then with Shaw's help, we could actually make a difference in Thunder Bay. And that was hugely important to me. I get to hang out with my friends. <laughs> I made great new friends here at Shaw and then just bringing out the community and, and allowing so many amazing people to have a voice and share their voice and just show showcase just how many amazing people live in this city and care about this city. Shaw. I would say come on out here to Shaw and talk to someone or talk to one of us, the hosts that are already doing TV programs. I know the welcome I got when I started doing a show here and they made it so easy and no one has ever restricted my voice which was so important to me. So if you have an idea for a show and there's interest in the city that people will want to watch it, I highly encourage you to contact Sean.